do you remember about being on the set for Back to the Future? Well, Back to the Future was Bob Zemeckis and Bob Gale, who I'd done uh, I Want to Hold Your Hand with. And that was their first film. And then we did Used Cars. Oh. And, uh, and then the third movie was Back to the Future. So Wendy Joe Sperber and I were in, you know, we didn't have to read. We just uh, got the parts because, you know, they always kind of kept us together. Uh, and when you read the script, you really weren't quite sure what was happening. But I do remember uh, in Back to the Future when we went to the screening and we saw the movie. <clears throat> and afterwards, it was like, wow, this standing ovation. I mean, really was, it was like, what did we just see? Because you really couldn't get it from the script. But then when you saw it on screen, it was just like, we just went on the greatest roller coaster ride ever. You worked during that Eric Stoltz phase, right? Do you yes, remember sir. the mood on the set when those changes were announced? Oh, yeah. Well, the mood, when, when he was doing his thing, uh, you know, he wanted to be called Marty. And it was a bit, uh, you know, on the set, it was a bit, uh, you're kind of walking around a little gingerly because you knew you had, there was an actor there that kind of, you, you know, it's that method actor. You know, the story is that he kind of was forced on to into the character by Universal, who was kind of high on him, but he just wasn't right for the part. I don't know, it just didn't, I, I, it wasn't working. The comedy wasn't working. And I don't know how, maybe a month into it, they put a little reel together and showed Universal and just said, you know, what do you think? And they kind of agreed, like, you know, he wasn't right. And then Mike was there, and Mike was working uh, his TV show during the day, and then we would film our stuff at night. All of our stuff was done at night. You know, my what my involvement in he just would sleep in the car or he worked his butt off for that thing. Really did. Did you notice a noticeable improvement when Mike came out of the set? Did you go, okay, this is working? Uh yeah. There was it was definitely on the lighter side where it should have been. Uh yeah. Oh yeah, you definitely the tone was completely different. To be in, in that franchise. Uh, to be in the Superman franchise, I've been I've been a, a lucky Screen Actors Guild member for for all that stuff.